Construction season has arrived in earnest and it is taking its toll along one of the busiest main roads in Metro Detroit. Glad you're with us for Local 40 at 6. I'm Devin Skillian. I'm Kimberly Gill. Southfield Road is down to one lane for a resurfacing project and suddenly neighborhoods along the route are filled with cars avoiding the orange barrels. Businesses aren't seeing the traffic they depend on. Yep, and of course it's taking longer to get just about anywhere in that area. Sean Lay live along the work zone in Lathrop Village with a closer look. Sean? We're live here in Lathrop Village and look, one road official said we're tearing up Lathrop Village because look, it, Southfield Road, so busy, needs a complete resurfacing, so the barrels are out and right after 696, it's going down to one lane, extremely slow right there. That's going to impact how you get around. Also, follow me this way, it's going to impact small business. We're talking about Tara Young's 44 Burrito. This is her dream, beautiful shop right here, deep fried burritos, but she needs to get customers in and out to survive. We put up drone four to show you what Southfield Road looks like right now through Lathrop Village. Orange barrels lining both sides and Southfield Road down to one lane in each direction. Traffic is at a snail's pace and will be this way until July. You can't get anywhere on it's Southfield. Ridiculous. It is early. It was like this at uh, nine o'clock this morning. Keith Dean lives in Lathrop Village. He knows this is a major resurfacing project and he knows how to avoid all this. I took the back way because I actually know the back way, but if I was just traveling through trying to get to Birmingham, there's only one way you can go. We all want smooth roads. We also want small businesses to thrive, like Tara Young's burrito business. But it's hard work, right? How much work? The most hardest work I've ever encountered. Young has something special cooking with her 44 burrito shop northbound Southfield Road right at 11 Mile. Her deep fried burrito is to die for. She has to let people know she's here, but now... Will I have enough traffic flowing? Will you? Do you know? Don't know. Right outside, two months of road work. If customers aren't pulling in off of Southfield Road, she'll bring her food out to Southfield Road to find customers. We've been connecting with the construction workers already, taking them little minis Good. so they all taste the food. You've been taking food out to them? Yes. So, Because you can't look at this. You, this is what you would dreamt of all this time. All this time. Back here live now. Listen, a couple of things to talk about 44 Burrito here on Southfield Road. Tara Young moved from 8 Mile Road to this beautiful new location. Now you've got road uh, traffic out here slowing down, but I like her hustle coming out here and feeding the road crews to get them in here to buy and also maybe getting uh, customers, if they're slowed down out here, to come in and also. And if that's not working, she's got her truck. She will bring the burritos out here. Guys, these are deep fried. Absolutely fantastic. But listen, we've seen this before when you've got traffic like this, a slowdown. You don't want to see a slowdown at the business, so we'll be keeping an eye out here. This is going to last until July, guys, out here on Southfield. Back to you. A long, expensive wait for many. All right, Sean.